segment we like to call Medical Mondays. Consider this, is your mouth a sore subject? Well, if you are tired of the aches and pains from a bad tooth, it's time to consider getting some expert care. And I had a chance to sit down with a doctor who has given his clients something to smile about. Well, this morning I'm joined by Dr. Kent Hamilton. He's the owner of Excellent Periodontist. Good to have you back. Thank you, Bridget. It's good to see you. I want to talk a little bit about implants versus root canal. Uh, talk about the difference between the two and how you know what option is best for you if you want to have some work done. Okay. You know, I'll, thank you for asking that question. I mean, it, it comes to the forefront. I mean, every day when we're treating patients, I had to use the word versus between the two of them. But we have two great technologies: root canals. Something that's been done for, for many, 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 many years. And we've heard quite right. a bit about it, right. yeah. And, and then implants, which, I mean, they're not new anymore. I mean, implants have a 20 year survival rate of over 90% in both the, in both the upper and lower arches. Mm -hmm. But. Um, so, as opposed to versus root canal versus implant, the differences in the you two. Yeah, the difference yeah. is on a root canal, basically what, what happens is the, the nerve and the artery, the blood supply to the tooth, is removed and, play, and replaced by, by inert filling. That leaves the, the tooth brittle. And over time, no matter how perfectly the root canal is done, it's just gonna oftentimes the tooth fractures regenerate. later. Right? Mm -hmm. And so the younger you are, the less we recommend root canal because the long-term prognosis is not as good. Where an implant, you place an implant and you're done. And it's, it's resolved and the implant, like I said, the 30-year survival rate is over 90%. So that's that's one of the reasons that we, the younger the patient, the more we lean toward the better long-term prognosis. Um, but you said who? I mean, how do you decide which one? But mainly your dentist. The dentist that you're working with is going to know all the different uh, variables that are associated, and it's going to be able to recommend and recommend that to you. But one of our main things is always ask. Would an implant be more appropriate in this situation? Good advice, Dr. Hamilton. Thanks so much. Thank you. Well, if you'd like to take advantage of some of those uh, offers that Dr. Hamilton is talking about, a screening, a consultation, he's located at 14500 San Pedro and Suite 200. You can call for an appointment at the number on your screen. It's 496 5603. Now, Dr. Hamilton will be back on Great Day SA again next week with another tip for healthy teeth. 